today I'm here with a new video and today I am here with a collab with one of my close friends here on YouTube. I am collabing with Debbie from Vinyl Beauty. We have collabed once, just the two of us I think, and then me, Debbie and Annette has done two collabs as well. And I'm finally doing a collab with Debbie again. I really, really love Debbie. I am going of course to leave her up here and down in the description and we are doing a face-off today and this face-off concept is created by Danielle Perry before she <laughs> her name was Danielle Schmidt she is now married congratulations to you Dan D Daniel. <laughs> Danielle if I'm not mistaken your last name is Perry I hope so me and Debbie is doing a face-off and Debbie actually draw five shades from this palette. This is the Prism palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is an old... Uh, I think it was a holiday palette, like a Christmas palette. And I have it, Debbie have it. We both really like it, but like we never use it. So Debbie asked if I wanted to do a collab with this one and yes. If you haven't seen this... I don't know how many of you that watch me have this, but it looks like this. I think this is one of my favorite palettes from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And Debbie draw five shades. <laughs> we at least got two of my favorite shades. And I'm going to swatch so you can see which shades we have to play with. So we have Lure, Pyramid, Saturn, Throne and sphere so <laughs> one of my or the two shades i really love is saturn of course and also sphere so we are going to do a makeup look with this and i actually think i know what i want to do i think there might be a chance that debbie do something similar to me i don't know it will be fun to see what she's doing Yes, <laughs> so I'm going to put on my eyes and then we get started. I actually think I just changed my mind what I want to do. So I think I'm going to take Sphere, this one, and take it in my whole crease. And this is pretty light. It was a long time since I used this shade. So I hope it will look kind of good. Maybe it will not even show up. I like never tend to use palettes that are limited edition on my channel. I don't know why, because I know there is people that have the same palette and or the same palette and I know that I am not a tutorial channel and I guess <laughs> that people are not going to try to do the same makeup look that I'm doing. So I don't know why I don't use my limited edition palettes, but I just don't. I like this shade, but it's really, really light. And it's not like, it fades out a little bit. I can't even remember when I used this shade latest. But this palette was actually pretty pretty early and I wish that Anastasia did more palettes like these and maybe I should talk a little bit about Debbie <laughs> I was like okay all of you that watch me know who Debbie is but maybe not okay just okay I'm going in with throne and lure on my lid yes where am I no, I think I take a whole shimmer lid actually and go in with throne and pyramid instead. This is not what I <laughs> plan to do in the beginning. But okay, maybe not all of you that watches me watch Debbie. So Debbie, she is from the UK and I have been following Debbie for a really long time. She is pretty new on YouTube you and you but she has I think it's a little over a year that she has been 
have been doing YouTube now? It must be more. One and a half. I don't know. I almost have followed her since the beginning. Um, Annette introduced us. And I really love Debbie's channel. She has such unique and cool style and she does amazing looks. And like wings, I never do like a wing liner, but she do wings and it just looks amazing. And she also loves cool lipsticks as I do and she's really creative and... I really like to watch Debbie's videos and she often puts up longer videos and I just love that. So if you haven't checked out Debbie you should really do. She does a lot of similar things as I'm doing and she tests out much in the brands but also like more expensive brands and also she has an amazing Urban Decay collection. Amazing. Back to this. I don't know if this was a good idea. I want to like blend throne into sphere. And maybe it's working. And then I will go in with Pyramid, this one, and take it on the rest of my lid. And I'm just going to do complete shimmer look. But okay, then I have two shades left, which is Saturn and Lure. I don't know if these go together. I think we just have to wait and see because that is my option right now. Okay, I don't remember how this is. I will try without any glitter glue first. Okay, I think I need to cut my crease for this. So, okay, I am going to cut my crease and I'm doing a half cut crease with my glitter primer from NYX. Just because I really want Pyramid to show and be really intense. Okay, and then I'm going in with Pyramid and we will see how this will look now. Hopefully better. Yes, it looks so much better. And I take it a little bit over... F oh! This on top of throne looks amazing. Okay, this looks really cool. It like went from just gold to like a greenish gold. And I think I want to go in with sphere a little bit more. In here, maybe I take another brush for that. I often, when I do like a cut crease, I want to go in with my crease shade a little bit kind of deeper in my in the crease just to have it a little bit more blend together. But okay, I think this is so much more fun what I plan to do from the beginning. I really like this. I don't know if Sphere was that good. I wish that my crease was a little bit deeper. Okay. Nothing I can do about it now. Okay, so I will cut this crease as well. I don't think you need to see it. So I will fix that and fix my base and my brows and fix this a little bit. Let's blend it a little bit here. 
fix my base and my brows and then I come back and we do the under eyes and I'm going to try to figure this out to figure these two shadows out I don't know what I want to do but I know I think yeah I'm taking the brush that I had thrown on the darker shade and take it like the whole crease in here Okay, I think I just have to be satisfied like this. So I fix the other eye, my base, and then I come back. Time to try to have the two lost shades into this look. I think I actually will try to take a Saturn on my whole lower lash and then go in with Lure and see if I can deepen it down. Like out here to go together with Born. We'll see. If it looks good or not. But I start with Saturn. And tap it off. And then I take Lure and see how this will look on top of Saturn. I have no idea. Yeah, maybe. I don't even know if it shows. Maybe a little actually. And as the last thing, I want to take Pyramid, this one that I had in here and put a little bit in my inner corner. So I take my pinky and just press it in there. Just like to have something in here. And I think I also want to take Sphere and have it do I, yeah. take a little bit of Sphere, 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 Sphere. Just have it like down here. Don't know if this is a good idea or not, but so I think I am happy like this. Kinda, if I would have done this look with the shades I wanted to, I would have taken Frown and maybe this black, I think it's black at least, on the outer half. But now this is the face off, so <laughs> this is what we get. So I will just put on mascara, something in my waterline and a lipstick. So, this is the finished look for my waterline. I used one uh, Vivid Brights Island from Kick, no, NYX. This is Shebang for my lips. I used Unspoken from Nabla because I love this one. And yeah, that was all for this look. I really <laughs> like it, actually. I would have changed the lower lash, but thrown together with Pyramid on my lid looks amazing. So I'm so, so happy with this. That. Jesus. And yeah, I want to thank you Debbie for doing a collab with me, it's always it's so so fun to do a collab with you and it was so fun to finally use the Prism palette again. I am sure that Debbie is going to tell you if you watch her video which year this is from. I'm not going to because I don't know and I could google but it's just not the way I work. So. That is my look with the Prism palette. I really hope you liked this video. Don't forget to check out Debbie. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So you don't miss any of my videos. Whew. And I hope I will see you in the next one. Bye.